Hello everyone, I hope you have seen my previous video in which I was running Apple Mac OS on an old PC. So some of my viewers asked some doubts regarding Hackintosh. So today in this video, I am going to clarify the doubts about Hackintosh. So let's begin. Hackintosh are basically a computer system that runs Apple operating system on Apple non-certified hardware. These non-certified hardware are nothing but our laptops and desktops that are capable of running Windows and Linux operating systems. Apple manufactures its own systems known as Macintosh. The alternative or the systems that we have made compatible to run Apple Mac OS are called Hackintosh. As you all know that Apple systems are quite expensive and it cannot be affordable by everyone. Hackintosh enables users to experience the real features and environment of Apple operating system. Basically, Hackintosh is creating a chance for users to understand the basic potential of a real macOS. By building a Hackintosh, we are actually violating the end user license agreement of Apple Mac OS. You won't be jailed unless and until you are not producing cloned Apple products and selling it in the market. If you are doing such actions, then you will be facing severe problems from Apple International Corporation. The answer is no. Apple Mac OS is designed to support only on Apple certified systems. Since Hackintosh is a non-certified system, we should make sure that the hardware we are using in a Hackintosh is closely matching to the hardwares that are being used in a real Macintosh. Otherwise, we can't turn a PC into a Hackintosh. The answer is no. Even after setting up a Hackintosh, it is not guaranteed that you can access all the features of a real Mac. Now talking about the performance, the performance of a Hackintosh can be either better or worse than a real Mac. And this entirely depends upon the hardware you have selected for building the Hackintosh. It is not impossible to build a Hackintosh. There are lots of online Hackintosh communities that help any beginner to build a perfect Hackintosh. From my experience, I can say that if you have got an interest, time and a compatible hardware, then definitely you can build a perfect Hackintosh. I hope I have clarified your doubts regarding Hackintosh. But still, if you have got some more doubts, please write your doubts in the comment section. I will definitely answer your queries. See you in the next video. Till then, take care. Goodbye.